Nicole? Rod and Megan, hundreds at the Cornhusker Marriott came to celebrate him not as a congressman, not as a governor, but just as Charlie. In a room full of some of Nebraska's more prominent influencers. <laughs> Laughter, remembering a man, Nebraska born and raised, who spent his entire life serving others. My dad uh, entered public service for sort of an old-fashioned reason. He wanted to serve the public. Former Congressman and Governor Charlie Thone died on March 7th at age 94. He had a successful career, even played integral roles in the investigations into the assassinations of both Martin Luther King Jr. and President Kennedy. Thone was an advocate for true bipartisanship in the government, but those who know him closest say it's what he did outside of politics. Politics. He was a very rural uh, Nebraskan at heart and he loved Nebraska and he loved serving people in Nebraska. He had such just such a very big heart. Thone was a man who developed close relationships with the likes of President Reagan and other world dignitaries and as a UNL graduate still held true to his Nebraska roots. He was extremely proud to be able to serve the people of Nebraska, the state that he loved with all his heart and all-consuming love. Among the many memories shared today was Charlie's personal mantra, accentuate the positive. And people were stickers of the campaign buttons you saw in the video there that he had when he ran for governor in 1978. Yeah, great story, Nicole. And as we mentioned last week, Charlie Thone was very instrumental in getting Channel 8 on the air back in 19. Yeah, a really special moment for us just mm -hmm. to know that he did play such a big role right. in us getting on the air. And Rod, I know you were there for that. Yeah, I remember it well. Thank you, Nicole.